As the world grapples with the realities of climate change, sustainable solutions to traditional technologies have never been more critical. The automobile industry is at the forefront of this shift, moving away from the internal combustion engines, ICE, that have dominated for over a century, towards more ecologically responsible electric vehicles. However, while this transformation is well underway, Porsche, a titan of the luxury car market, has chosen to explore a somewhat alternative route. While Porsche is committed to the development of EVs, with plans to produce electric and hybrid versions of their iconic models, the automaker is not banking entirely on electricity. Instead, Porsche has shown a remarkable interest in a technology known as e-fuels, a move that, if successful, could potentially reshape our understanding of sustainable transportation. This strategic decision highlights Porsche's commitment to environmental responsibility without entirely leaving behind its established product lines and its passionate customer base. E-fuels, or synthetic fuels, are not a novel idea. Yet, recent technological advancements and policy shifts, notably within the European Union, have created a more encouraging environment for the development of e-fuels, sparking renewed interest and investment in this area. In a significant twist, EU legislators announced that vehicles running on ICE could continue to be sold after 2035, provided they operate on e-fuels. This announcement is a clear indication of the growing faith in the potential of e-fuels and their capacity to serve as a bridge between traditional ICE vehicles and the impending fully electric future. Porsche views this new legislative landscape as a golden opportunity to reinvigorate its beloved sports cars, adding a green twist to their appeal. By harnessing the power of e-fuels, Porsche imagines a future where its cherished models continue to excite car enthusiasts, but without the burden of environmental guilt. The German automaker has teamed up with Siemens Energy and other global partners to launch the Haru Oni project in southern Chile. The project's ambitious aim is to develop synthetic fuels that are virtually carbon neutral. The choice of Chile as the location for this innovative project might seem peculiar at first, However, the Magallanes province, where the project is set, offers perfect conditions for wind energy generation. The Haru Oni project plans to utilize this abundant renewable energy to produce synthetic petrol, making the entire process nearly CO2 neutral. If successful, this groundbreaking initiative could revolutionize not only the automobile industry, but also other sectors heavily dependent on fossil fuels, dramatically impacting our global sustainability goals. But what exactly are e-fuels? Simply put, e-fuels are synthetic fuels created from renewable sources. Carbon dioxide is captured directly from the atmosphere and hydrogen is extracted from water. This process drastically reduces greenhouse gas emissions and mitigates our reliance on fossil fuels, aligning closely with the global sustainability movement. Perhaps one of the most attractive aspects of it is that it can be used in existing ICEs. This compatibility eliminates the need for significant infrastructural changes or costly upgrades, making e-fuels an attractive proposition. Porsche's commitment to the development of e-fuels reflects its broader strategy for sustainable development. It's a thrilling blend of innovation, environmental stewardship and customer satisfaction. The company sees e-fuels as a practical supplement to electric vehicles, particularly when it comes to maintaining existing vehicle fleets in an eco-friendly manner. By ensuring that its popular models continue to grace the roads, now powered by cleaner fuels, Porsche is taking significant steps to minimize its carbon footprint. Porsche's exploration of e-fuels extends beyond the confines of the automotive industry. It offers a viable solution for other transport sectors grappling with the challenges of electrification. In areas like aviation and shipping, the prospect of electrification presents a host of technical and logistical challenges. It could serve as an effective alternative, providing these sectors with a feasible path to sustainability. However, the e-fuel trajectory is not without its challenges. While Porsche and its partners are striving to produce carbon-neutral e-fuels, several obstacles need to be addressed. For one, the commercial supply of e-fuels is virtually non-existent at present, and the projected cost is considerably higher than conventional fuels. In addition, the efficiency of it compared to the direct use of renewable electricity in EVs is a major concern. 
The production process of e-fuels is energy intensive and a large part of the energy is lost in the process of converting electricity to fuel and back to electricity. Moreover, there's the matter of ensuring that cars on the road after 2035 are genuinely powered by e-fuels and not fossil fuels. Policymakers and industry stakeholders have yet to propose a comprehensive solution for this challenge, but the issue is very much on the agenda. It's a crucial aspect of the equation that requires careful consideration and proactive action. In spite of these challenges, the potential benefits of e-fuels cannot be ignored. The prospect of continued use of beloved ICE vehicles without damaging the environment is indeed enticing. As Porsche continues its journey towards sustainable mobility, it will be interesting to see how this balance between electrification and e-fuels evolves. Porsche's proactive approach to sustainability is commendable, and it opens up a dialogue for other automakers to consider. While the focus on EVs is necessary and crucial, e-fuels present an alternative approach that deserves attention. Perhaps as we move towards a greener future, a combination of electric vehicles and e-fuels will become the norm, ensuring that the joy of driving continues unabated, but without the associated environmental costs. As we progress further into the 21st century, it's clear that the automotive industry must evolve to meet the pressing demands of climate change. The e-fuels versus EV debate mirrors this significant transition. Both technologies have the potential to drastically reduce greenhouse gas emissions and contribute to a more sustainable future. And while EVs have garnered the majority of attention in recent years, it's exciting to see companies like Porsche exploring the potential of e-fuels. At this stage, it's challenging to predict the future of e-fuels and their role in the broader automotive landscape. However, Porsche's commitment to this innovative technology is a testament to the automaker's forward-thinking approach and willingness to experiment with alternative solutions. As the company continues to invest in e-fuels, the world will be eagerly watching to see if this bold experiment proves successful. So, where does this leave us? Undeniably, the electrification of the automobile industry is essential for a sustainable future. However, the potential of e-fuels as a complementary solution should not be overlooked. As Porsche and other industry leaders continue to innovate and push the boundaries of what's possible, we can look forward to a future where sustainable transportation options are not only viable, but varied and exciting. What are your thoughts on this new development in the automotive world? Are you intrigued by the prospect of carbon neutral e-fuels, or are you more inclined toward the electric revolution? Share your thoughts in the comments below.